Hi there and welcome back to Baldoscape. I'm Baron and I pretty much hate this level. Whoever designed this level was a really mean person. out of here. Oh, who are you? Looks like we're on the right track. We follow the trail of dead bodies. You're at the end of your rope, I'll wager. Winsky Perro Perorade. I think we fought him. He was one of the guys that tried to kill uh, the High Dukes. Well, well, I thought it would be you. Quite a little family reunion shaping up now, isn't it? I knew you would follow. You two are of the same blood. You must take the fight to him, lest he strike you down at his leisure. Not that it will matter. You have already beaten him. His plans are in ruins and his allies are fleeing in droves. Such glorious goals they were, though none understood the true desire behind them. None but me, that is. Unfortunately, I'm not expendable. But I expected no less. What was your role in this? Why did you help him if you knew you were to be cast aside? What was my role? I was Saravok's mentor. I tutored him in the blackest of rituals. If he were to succeed, there is no doubt I would be among the dead, but my name would live on in his wake. There are things beyond dead if you death if you die in the right fashion. And how could there be not a place in history for the architect that shaped the actions of the ascending lord of murder? You would not understand. You were born to affect the realms. The rest of us must carve our own place by whatever means necessary. Uh, ascending? What was he planning? The war with M makes no sense. You must know his plan by now. You have practically followed his every move. Likely you are driven by the same desires as well, though you have channeled them in a different fashion. No, war with M was not his true goal. Saravok is no profiteer. The slaughter was all he wanted, with enough lives lost in the initial battles to ignite the fire in his own divine blood. He thought death on an appropriate scale would cause him to ascend. Perhaps he would have, but who can really say? If you have the arrogance of a god and can kill like a god, who's to say you are not a god? Hmm, his plans are in shambles. You will live to be accountable for your part in this. Your charity is admirable. You have definitely taken a separate path than Cerebrook, though I wonder if it shall truly matter in the end. Leave me. I am no longer a threat to you or anyone. I'm just going to rest here a while. Okay, and I'm not going to explore more of that fucking dungeon. It annoys the hell out of me. I just want to leave. You must gather your party before venturing forth. All right, all right! Okay, one house seems to be intact. Okay. Where are we now? At least here we have space again. Well, at least I thought so. Oh, we see an enemy? Where? Yes, Kiba. Yes. Where did you see? Oh, there. What's that? A ghoul. Uh, can I help really? You? What do you want? Nature servant. If you oh, wait, so. what would you have me do? Fire away. Dead already. Well. What's that? Hezio. 
Hi, Hazio. Are you alone? I don't know. Let's find out. Tempest, give us victory! Bang! This one is dead. Oh, we have a lot, lots of nice Hurry little up. enemies. Who are you? Robin? Wundai? I think you're a mage. You go down first. What would you have me and do? And another fireball. <laughs> oh, I killed you before. <laughs> Actually, it was somewhat early, but then again, it doesn't matter. A rather strange place to meet living members of the Sunlit Realms. I am curious as to why you are here. Could I rightly assume that you have something in common with the man Saravak Anchev? Before we say anything more, would you be willing to tell us who you are? I am Robin, my friends and I are mercenaries in the employ of the Iron Throne. We have been sent to hunt down Cerebrog. Seems as if he went crazy and started murdering all who got in his way, including Realtor. And the throne don't take too well to having their high-ups killed. You know, the longer I talk to you, the more familiar you become. You're Havitcher Blomi, aren't you? Well, 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 it seems as if we have gotten lucky. Killing you will give us a nice hefty bonus. Sorry about this, but you're not wanted dead or alive. Only dead. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> what the fuck? I don't know how much longer I can go on. Okay. What was that? We took some serious damage here. Save versus mount? Did it somehow turn it back on us? Oh well. How about we kill you? <laughs> You're a queer fellow. Shit. It's the most glorious... Um, something what would you have most me do? Unnatural Let's hearing. try this again. I want no part of it. But, uh, can I help you? Yes. Nature servant away your wish. So we kill you. Oh, I not really not in oh, this. Was all easy. right, all right. Okay, let's see. I mean, we could haste ourselves. Oh, let's see what that looks about. You need something stranger. Stop it. Hurry up! Web for the win. Oh, now I see it. Ah, fuck it. He has uh, arrows of explosions. That's rather unfortunate. Um, what would you have me do? You annoy me. Can I How often do I have to kill you? Hurry up! Haste. Fuck you. What would you have me do? My blade will cut down the side. Hurry! If you insist. Okay, let's try this again. Where's the fucking ghoul? That one. Now we kill the mage. Where am I? What 
would you have me do? Okay. Your wish? Hurry up! You gotta be kidding me. What the fuck? All right, all right. Another fireball in here. This time we were victorious. What did we get? I don't need that. Whee! That was quite a battle, I must say. Okay. Ring of protection plus one. So what's that here? Arrows plus two. Hmm? Arrows of detonation. That's that's rather nice. And we have arrows of piercing, arrows of ice, arrows of biting. Uh, started level armor plus one. Hurry up! I really think we should heal ourselves. We're in pretty bad shape now. Yes, O oh omnipresent authority figure. Quiet, <laughs> 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 
You've a task? Yes. Hello? Aqua in mud hut. Aqua in mud hut. Thy temper shield! Serve them away! Aqua in mud hut. What is your plan? Aqua in mud hut. Yes, oh, oh, my present authority figure. Hello? Aqua in mud hut. Hurry up! Okay. Let's move on. <clears throat> if you insist. I must talk to you in private. These oh, you are again. troubled times. Hello again, Hewitcha Blow Me. I fear this time I have not come to speak and must take up arms against you. You have. You have done what you must, I suppose. Serovok knows of my treachery, though. He has forsaken me, left me to die in your palm. I must fight to regain his trust, his attention. And so I stand before you, knowing that if I defeat you, he will continue his plans elsewhere, and I shall lose him. And if you defeat me, you shall go to on to kill him. He will not yield to either of us. I have, I have no chance. There's always a choice. Do not throw your life away. There may always be a choice, but the choosing has become unbearable. I have but two duties, and both leave me with little hope. No, young one, I must face you now. I will not harm you. You are not my enemy. You must. I stand before you. I block your path. I am an obstacle that holds you back. You will free. You will fight me. You will free. You will fight me. I mean, I understand you will fight me, but you will free? I don't understand that. If you would throw your life away, then you are already dead. If that is your choice, then you do not need me. You... You are not so alike after all. He would not have hesitated for an instant. Perhaps... Perhaps it is more than his blood that makes him the way he is. I have been a fool. Go. Your path is clear and I wish you well. One last word in passing, beware of the blindness of those who would follow, and the damnable lure of those who would lead. A fool I was, and others are still. Ready yourself for the fire to come. Okay, so we did not fight. I have no idea where we're going, but I guess we're gonna get somewhere eventually. A fucking skeleton. Like hell. Wait a second. What would you have me do? Maybe there are more skeletons here. Then again, maybe not. Well, I guess there were more skeletons. There. Huh. All right, all right. Yeah, I built them up nice and proper. Oh, that's a rather large area, I give you that, but it's easier to navigate than those, that bled, bloody maze I was in in the last video. I have more space here, it's much more convenient. Oh wait, what is that? The end of the map? So, uh, well, where do we have to go now? Now we can probably find out. Errors of detonation, you gotta be kidding me, man. That's mean stuff. <laughs> but then again, it's really difficult to handle. In close quarters, they would... Is that? That's, I guess, where we have to go. Oh, well done. Go there. <coughs> uh, what is moving behind that door? Or is it just a bird in front of the door? There's some 
something most unnatural here, and I want no part of it. So, we shall see how that works out. Okay. I guess I will probably rest here. Tonight you sleep hunted by all, and wake in a dream hunted by one. Tonight you are the monster everyone claims you are. The kobold scorned like a rodent. The ogre that children fear comes in the night. The mobs and their torches now come for you, counting you among the creatures you once did hunt. Or so someone would have you believe. Once again you hear the voice, a voice that now makes no secret of its origins. It speaks of destiny and nature, and of evils bred in the bone. It says you will never be free of the mob, that they will hunt you for what you are. Murder and death run through your heart, and accepting that will supposedly give you power. The essence of Baal within you cannot be ignored. But you have not ignored it. You realize that from the first you have fought the very blood in your veins, fought dagger and claw for each victory, and ultimately you have triumphed. With righteous will, you have turned the dark forces within you to good purpose. Whatever the foundation of your being, you have remade yourself in your own image. Amidst threats it does not yet know are empty, the voice tries to play upon your doubts, but finds none. As you stare unwavering, the presence grows weaker and weaker. As it fades from your mind, one warning does stand out amidst the din. It speaks of others that will listen where you have not. Others that will embrace what you have rejected, and others that will be your death. This describes but one man, and you know of no other it could be. He who orchestrated your fall, deceived your comrades, and deserves all that your justice shall meet upon him, Saravak. He is a debt that must be paid to the whole of the Sword Coast. You awake sure of your cause, and of what must be done. Okay. We gained another drop on Holy Might. That's nice. Thy temper shield! You've we need some more healing. Okay, I guess we will do some buffing now. By temper shield. What is your command? You've a task. Nature servant awaits. Um, wait. That is twenty four, that is only twenty three. So you drink that. You drink that. And that. So, what else do we have? I guess that's enough. Now. What would you have me By do? temper shield. A chant. Your wish. No. A draw upon. I have now a strength of nineteen, dexterity of twenty. Draw upon holy might. 
Strength of 21, Dexterity of 22, and Constitution of 20. <laughs> okay, and finally, I guess, a haste. Or maybe a blur, too. And... Now a haste. Haste? Let's get in here. Have need of me? What would you have if you Let's insist? see how that works out. Maybe you will stay quiet when you're dead. Okay. There is Sarabok. <coughs> yes, I can, you but are try. Indeed family. No other could have lived to oppose me in person. Of course, it will not matter in the end. Ultimately, I will prevail, and a new era will be born unto the realms. Your evil way ends here tonight. This god stays dead, and you will join him. Face me! The new Lord of Murder. Um, that's not what he says, actually. Yes, Robert. Bring your rage to bear, and we shall end this in a manner befitting our heritage. Face me. Face the new Lord of Murder, Angelo Tazak. Reveal yourselves, and let's finish this now. <laughs> There's Angelo and Semaji. I don't really know. Oh, he's they're casting a spell here. Your wish? That's not funny. I say we get out of that. All right, all right. Oh, it looks like this one is being held. Running in there is not the best. Oh, what is the final save? Oh, awesome. What would you have me do? All right, all right. Oh, yeah, we already had that.
face me. Can I help you? Oh wait, I should have. Your wish? Doesn't matter. Hurry up! What would you have me do? You gotta be kidding me. That's not the solution. Where is it? Freedom Magic Shielding. What would you have me do? Your wish? All right, all right! That was a trap. Face me! Face the new Lord of Murder! Now would be the time to actually explore the character farm. Wait, there's a Haywood file. Oh, it's the one I probably used when I started. Um, LP? Let's call it Haywood 2 then. So, now what the only you one that do? remains are you. Can I help you? How about I can, but you. try. Yes. As you wish. Nature servant awaits as you direct. Oh, 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 your wish? Hurry up! <laughs> and we magic missile gear. <laughs> Oh, Saravok has fallen. The battle is won. A final save game has been made in the final save slot. All player gener generated characters have been exported. Character 1, etc. Okay, so I didn't have to export it manually. <laughs> more level, too bad <laughs> she doesn't have anything from that. <laughs> she doesn't get anything from it.
that my friend wants a Baldur skate. Oi, oi, oi. That's actually been the first time that I finished that game. Something about one hundred thirty videos, sixty-five hours, something around that. What I gotta say is, this has really been an adventure. It wasn't always fun. There were times when I really found it, the game to be quite annoying, you know, all the districts in Baldur's Gate, the thief maze, all the levels with very narrow passages in combination with the poor wayfinding routines. That would suck. But then again, the game really told a nice and intriguing and very well written story. I really enjoyed that. So that that game really has a, has a land. And I can't see the qualities of it. The qualities that it has. Yeah. So, that was Baldur's Gate and the Tales of the Sword Coast. I, well, I, I think I got almost everything. I didn't get all the quests, but almost, I guess. So, well, I hope you had fun. I surely had fun playing the game. And I'm really looking forward to Baldur's Gate 2. So, yes, the adventures of Haven Chablomi will continue in Baldur's Gate 2. And I hope you join me there when we visit the fair city of Am. <laughs> We've heard much about that city. We will see the thieves guild there. That the yeah, will really be fun, I guess. Yeah, so thank you very much for watching. That's all that's actually left for me to say. And we'll see each other in Baldur's Gate 2. So have a nice day and take care. Bye bye.